read something about if you want to do things like remember to take your vitamins or you know try to make YouTube videos that you should do something called habit stacking so that you put the thing that you don't do with something that you do do already um, so that's why you're getting the opportunity to watch me eat some cottage cheese standing up while I wait for my eggs to hard boil. All those people who were like, I can't wait for you to make YouTube videos again, are like, we would like to reconsider. Honestly though, I do have a hot tip for you where um, hard boiled eggs are concerned. I found the method used by the pioneer woman. It is magical. The worst thing about hard boiling eggs is peeling the eggs because there's always little tiny pieces of shell. Oh God, it's time for the ice bath. Oh no. Wait, 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 wait. Here's the situation. You bring the water in a saucepan to a boil. And then I recommend you get yourself one of these little guys and you just lower the eggs in once it's boiling. You bring it down to sort of gentle rumbling in the, <laughs> you know what I mean. You cook them for 13 minutes. And then when the 13 minutes are up, you take the eggs and you put them in the ice bath for five minutes. And then after that, you can peel them. When you see how well this works, it is going to absolutely blow your mind. Mm. It tastes so good. So here we go. Here are our little eggs. We just fish them out and plunge them into the cold, deep. Da -da -da. Look at that steam. Now I make, okay, okay, okay. It's really insistent for this early and for not paying rent. Shh. Protein. It's the key. So anyway, we're just waiting and waiting. Oh, I should probably, hang on. Does anyone else hate the Tupperware situation in their life? I do. It's never quite right. I never quite find the tops to things or I find them too late. It makes me nuts. It like truly makes me insane. And I know recently, aha, no, that's not it. Oh, why are there? I have so many round bowls and so many square lids, which is, that seems like something that sounds like, no. Okay, okay, okay. Here we go. I think that most of all, what we're really enjoying is my, my attention to detail and my desire to have decent lighting. <coughs> this is the moment of truth. Now watch this business. Look at this, now watch, ready? You get in there. Oh, this is so satisfying. There we go. La, 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 la. Look at this. It comes off in these great big chunks. And now this will be in the fridge for a little snack or a little breakfast. And um, you know, it's somewhat decent for you. Now here's how I feel about hard boiled eggs. Hard boiled eggs, I think, these are an at home thing. So like, if you want to eat this in your car on the way to work, that's fine. Um, but one time I was on a flight. I don't recall at this moment where I was going, but I was sitting next to a woman who suddenly opened this little thing of tin foil and inside were a bunch of hard boiled eggs on a plane. I know that people have dietary restrictions, issues, things that they need to do, but holy smokes, do you really need to eat hard boiled eggs on a plane? The, it literally already smells like farts. Maybe they figure that's, that makes sense. All right, so there we go. Put this in here, put this in here. There you go, bonus episode. One cup, four eggs. 
See you later. There is actually no reason whatsoever for this particular portion of the video, except that I just felt it necessary to provide some sort of evidence that I don't always look feral. Okay, that's it.